$52,000, that is taxpayers' money, was spent by the Ministry for Pacific Peoples to promote Labour MPs in a series of post-budget breakfast events. 52 grand for a couple of breakfasts seems a bit excessive in a cost of living crisis. I'm not the Minister for Pacific Peoples. I'd have to have a good look over all those details, but it's not unusual. That's part of democracy. All right, it was $24,000 on catering costs, $5,000 on venue costs, and more than $23,000 on audio and visual costs. How do you feel now? Going out and talking to New Zealanders is part of, of the important work that government does. Not only was it massive wasteful spending in the middle of a cost of living crisis, but it was billed as come and meet the uh, Pacific Caucus, which is a, uh, a Labour party part of their caucus. So it was a, a series of breakfasts to introduce the Pacific caucus to Pacific leaders. So that is taking a very political bent with public money. That is not careful use of taxpayers' money in the first place. Uh, and secondly, it's being used to promote a Labour Party caucus. Uh, and this comes on the back of a, a $50,000 leaving party that the Ministry of Pacific Peoples uh, were warned about and chastised over by uh, Barbara Ebrins, the minister. Here we are again. It is a pattern of behaviour from a government that is just addicted to wasteful spending uh, and has no regard for taxpayers' money.